position of an old person using new technology? It tickles me. What if this old person really tickles you? <laughs> I'll play, I'll play. George, how y'all been? Good, good. Hey, fix your place up, looking snazzy. Oh, thanks. Like, uh, Shell Mall? No, using all the letters. Like, Imelda Shellman. Did you just do that in your head? Yes, why? Never mind. Just put it. Tell me. Well, the kid was right. It's just the thermostat. Yeah, yeah. So how long to fix it? Nothing. 20 minutes. Can I help? Well, sure. Grab yourself a pair of coveralls and have at it. Thanks. Are you some bitches? When I grow up, will I be a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader? Not likely. Darn it. Did you tell her? Why don't you tell her? Tell me what? Herschel offered me a part-time job. Over the next few days, I ran to my Meemaw's house so we could save the 8-bit princess. And if it's unclear how important this was, let me say it again. Woo! <laughs> so me and Herschel dropped the engine on this pacer today. It was so cool. Sword, use the sword! Your yap is open again. Hello? What? It's past his bedtime. Let's go. Oh, come on. Five more minutes? No. Now say goodnight to your grandson. You'll play with... Ooh, uh, I was wondering if Georgie could come by after school tomorrow and help me out. Well, I don't know, Herschel. He's got football practice. Hmm. What's going on? Herschel's asking if you want to work after school. Great. I'll be there. What about football? What about it? I mostly sit on the... Even while sleeping, my quest to save the princess continued, which was quite a departure from my usual dreams, such as determining the coolest prime number, which, by the way, is seven... I was on my way to the bathroom. You know, it was all people in our bladders. I'll call you right back. Fat Fibber. You're playing... Not that it's any of your business, but I needed a break from your brother. I certainly understand that. He's an acquired taste. Like grape nuts. The first time I tried it, I thought I was eating gravel. But then I put a little sugar on it and let it get soggy. Now it's in my school today. Sure, what's the reason? His Aunt Imelda's not doing well. He's asked to see him before she goes. <gasps> oh, I am so sorry. Does she want to see his older brother also? Not she didn't like him as much. Okay. You're not going to ask me what... Would you like to fight the last boss? You think I'm ready? We couldn't have gotten here without you. Well, except for the part you did when I was sleeping. We're having a moment here. Don't ruin it. So listen. I feel bad about Georgie and this whole football thing. Thanks, but it's not on you. I appreciate that. But you got to know, there's an upside to this. And that would be? Your son will give you chills. You're not to say it. Whenever we had a leaky football, he knew exactly where the hole was. I am telling you, your boy's got a future in the tire business. Goodyear, Firestone, somebody's going to scoop him up first round. Just return to our ordinary lives? I guess so. Or we could just go to the store and buy another game. I got goosebumps. What's this boy genius thankful for? Homework for Thanksgiving? 